You are launching this new thing called Shine Together, which, you know, it's sort of an outgrowth of, of Me Too and Time's Up, but, you know, spinning it forward and, you know, changing the conversation to a positive one. You know, what is the movement that you were hoping to create here? So my co-founder, Jamie Vigiano, who worked with me at TaskRabbit, she and I had this idea that there was room for a positive conversation to happen within this movement. And so Shine Together is really dedicated to celebrating and amplifying women's stories and really celebrating the everyday heroes that you might not typically hear about. So, you know, the, the stories about harassment and sexism continue to you know, pour out. We've got, you know, a new story out of Microsoft that they got over 200 complaints from 2010 to 2016 about sexual harassment and discrimination. I keep getting questions about why hasn't the Me Too movement in Silicon Valley taken off more the way it has in Hollywood. You know, what needs to happen for that to happen and will it happen? Well, you know, here was really our inspiration. Both Jamie and I were deeply inspired by Valerie Jarrett, former senior advisor to President Obama, and all of the women in President Obama's cabinet and administration. They had made this pact, basically, to shine each other, to amplify each other's voices in meetings so that their ideas would be heard. Mm -hmm. So Jamie and I thought, what if you could take this concept of shine theory and apply it and scale it across all industries, across all different types of conversations? And that was really the precipice for the idea. And so we got Valerie on the phone mm -hmm. and we said, tell us how you did this and do you think we can scale it? Because what we do here in Silicon Valley, right, is we scale concepts, we scale companies. And Jamie and I are now working to see if we can scale this idea of shining a light on each other.